who had pulled someone out of a burning Humvee, risking his life. And when I went to pin it on him in front of the entire brigade, he stood at me, looked at me, said, Sir, I don't want the medal. I don't want the medal. You know why? He said, he died. He died, Mr. Vice President. I don't want the medal. How many nights does that kid go to sleep? Seeing that image in his head, dealing with it. I have a card I carry with me, my schedule. Every single day, I have my staff contact the Defense Department early in the morning. There's a black box in the bottom of it. And it lists U.S. daily troop update. U.S. troops died in Afghanistan and Iraq. 6,753, not plus 6,000, not 6,700, 6,753. Because every one of those warriors left behind an entire family, a community, for us. Every one of them. 52,419 wounded. But as a veteran can tell you, over 200,000 coming home with unseen wounds.